And my man, we gotta get right into it. I don't, I don't, I don't, again, I, I want to be able to say a bunch of stuff going in, but I, I don't know what I can say. I think I got most of what I needed to say out in the beginning, uh, or the end of the last one. Um, so that's what we're gonna do. Uh, hey, hi, ho, and howdy, everyone. My name is Shannon Olshuk, and welcome to the finale of Motherfucking Steins Gate. I love this show so fucking much. Fuck it at times, but I love it. Um, I guess I will really quickly jump this in here just to say, um, uh, again, I'm very sorry if I end up being very quiet through this, if I'm not super talkative, again, I'm really worried, um, even though I got my blood pumping, I'm like, fuck yeah, kick some ass, my man, you got this, um, I'm also like, what if you don't though, uh, just a small part of me is like, ah, but we got this, um, Anyway, uh, so, yeah, we have our plan. Boy got to save her, Sue. We know that fucking dickhead of a dad of hers is part of the reason she's in this fucking situation in the goddamn first place. We know we got, we know what we got to fix. We know we got to make young Okabe watch, or th- at least think that she died, no matter what happens. Which is sad. That's but it's okay because it brings us here in the end. It gets us to the man's being the fucking realist boy around and kicking ass. Um, again, I I think I will just throw this in here just because uh, it's one of those things where like I've noticed when it comes to the finales of series, a lot of the times that's when a lot of people will start watching. They'll 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 be like oh oh hey it's this person has all of their reactions of the series done cool I can binge through them shit like that or they will jump into the end first suit that first thoughts on first thought final thoughts and then go back and see shit or sometimes they'll just jump into the finale because that's the big one that they want to see. Um, so to anyone who happens to be new, uh, welcome. You fucking goddamn, this has been a trip. Uh, I hope you enjoy it. If you end up sticking around and seeing more, um, <clears throat> it, uh, yeah. Just be ready if you do go back. There's one episode that has a 28 minute long intro. I really, really like Suza. Um, anyway, point is, um, fuck. I, 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 I don't have a point. I just, I, I want to get into this episode. Um, no matter what happens, uh, I want to say a huge thank you. To everyone who joined me along with this, uh, it has, it is, it has been one of those just incredibly enjoyable experiences, and just in a series that I have grown to absolutely adore. Again, this is a series that I put off for fucking forever because I just I didn't know what to expect for it. I knew that everyone loved it. I had people have been telling me for years about it. I know he's just put it out because I didn't know exactly what it was. And I cannot be more mad and yet also incredibly happy with myself that I did. I'm, I'm mad because it took me this long to finally fucking get to it. And I'm so happy because it means I got to spend it with you guys and talking to you and learning and experiencing with you guys and falling on camera like a bitch. Um, at least just not this one. I just, if I can get through this episode, I can do it. Um, But yeah, I... I don't know. It's just, it's been a hell of an experience. It's, it's been one of the, the great ones here on the channel for me. Like it's one I can look back to and just have fond memories of like, again, I, I've been going through my whole channel, uh, the past few days going through and updating links to shit and descriptions and making sure everything is together the way it is fixing typos and thumb and titles and shit. Um, and doing that's been giving me a lot of memories, kind of stroll down memory lane on the channel. And this is one of those ones that I can be able to look back on at some point and be like, fuck, remember that time I went through fucking Steins Gate? That shit was am- fucking amazing. Because um, I've I have absolutely adored this one. I, again, I won't know exactly where to put it. Um at least not until the end of this episode, and I I would want to put it off until I saw the OVA as well. Um, And again, there's all the other shit. It's still a fucking movie. God damn, Steins Gate Zero. Um, We got a lot of shit to go through. Um, But uh, when... Yeah, I don't know. I don't know exactly where I'd put it, but it absolutely is one of my all-time favorites. I have enjoyed it immensely. I love these fucking characters. I... 
I don't know. I just adore them to death, and they're fucking kick-ass and adorable and nerds and great and dumb, and I love them, and they're kick-ass. Did I mention they're kind of kick-ass? Sousa is a fucking badass. Um, So is Okabe. Again, I, I give her a lot of credit, but this motherfucker over here... Time travel Jesus. I mean it. Um, But anyway, yeah, so... I just I want to say thank you for joining me, and I hope you guys enjoy this, and I hope I can uh, make it up to you guys in this uh, by the end of this with uh, something you guys can enjoy as a reaction as well. Um, again, I don't know when we're going to be getting to the other things. I don't know when we're going to be jumping into the OVA. Uh, it'll either be next week or the week after. Uh, as for if we're going to jump into the next show immediately after that, I'm not sure. Also, it's been occurring to me more and more as I go. It's very possible that I don't jump into school live after Steins Gate, but I instead maybe it's possible that maybe I'll end up moving Erased or Modica up for I think I'd move up Erased uh, because I think I do want to go directly from uh, Baka Monogatari into uh, Modica uh, since they're both Shaft shows. Uh, you know, um, makes sense in my head. Um but yeah, so it's possible we do that just so that since that's been something I've promised for a long time, it'll be something we jump into. Um, I'm not sure yet. Don't quote me on that. Um, I've also been thinking about the Bloom Into You thing a bit. Uh, definitely still going to be watching it because, again, I, I'm 100% looking forward to it. And it's the whole I, it's my Shannon's Choice thing. Um, but it's possible that I, I'm, I'm looking to do that slightly differently um, time wise uh, because I want to make sure everything. Works out as best as it can on the channel. Um, anyway, so that's that. Do I have anything else I need to say? I'm I'm just I'm trying to justify myself as as this being a Shannon L. Shook reaction uh, by making the intro really long. Um, and I don't know if I can anymore. Um, but yeah, don't know when we'll be jumping into um, the other stuff. But hopefully we'll be doing it here soon. Either way, again, after we do finish this, there will be a bit of a break before we get into Steins Gate Zero. Um, there's going to be at least about a series break in between. Um, but then again, uh, we will be jumping into it uh, just a bit after that. So, Because I, 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 I will kill to have some more of this shit in my life. It's fucking great. Um, anyway, with that, I think I'm officially... Uh, to the point where I, I can't say anything to buy time anymore. I think we got to jump into it. Um, again, I'm going to do my best to give my kind of final thoughts in the end. Um, but I don't know, man. It really depends on how I'm, I'm feeling. I will say this. If I don't, uh, I will absolutely make sure that I do, um, after episode 25, after the OVA or whatever, because I want to, as I definitely want to make sure that I, 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 I talk about it um, either way. So we're going to jump into it. <laughs> um, okay. We started here with episode number 24 of Steins Gate in three, two, one, go. Because it's adorable and sweet. It's me so happy to hear. I'm trying. But I mean, if it works, then that means I get my f my favorite best 
around forever. Uh, at the end of the series, that doesn't help me. Fucking love Sousa so much, man. I cannot express it. Let's do it, man. The fucking squad over here. <sighs> I'm anxious. <laughs> I'm anxious. But I'm optimistic, which doesn't always happen in a finales. I'm usually just terrified. And I'm still terrified. But I'm optimistic. I'm optimistically terrified. <laughs> uh, it makes me so happy that she's back. Like, there was always a part of me is like, come on, I know she'll, she, she's got to appear at least once more in the series. I got it. I need it in my life. And she's coming through, like, the realist in the, in the end, and I, I'm. Damn. Expedient. Describes them pretty well. Make the world tremble. Oh crap. It's <laughs> a smile and a half. He's. This man is like, we, we doing it, man. We winning. He's not wrong. <laughs> There's so fucking much, so much tension between those two. <laughs> She's pretty fucking kick-ass. Also, when they were really adorable together. Again, just two nerds, and I love it. <laughs> A little bit. Got 
Got to save everybody, though. What's up, boss? How you doing? It's a pleasant surprise I actually do know the answer to. <laughs> uh, it's a complicated story, but I'm not too beat up about it. Beat him over the head. Do whatever you got to do. I'm not saying we should kill her dad, but I'm just saying, if we had to, would that fuck everything up? Just saying, fuck that guy. Um... Kick that dickhead down a flight of stairs. <laughs> I'm old, adorable, old school chicken tender action. I love it. My area's got the fucking the the look on life we all need. We need more people like that in this world. It ain't godly, but it's great. <laughs> Man, damn well better. I was just kind of joking a little bit with a knocking her the fuck out. That's not great. He's not wrong. I just keep spitting in it while I'm at work. Fuck. I, you need to never do that again. It's...
A little bit. Fuck. Fucking punk prick. You good boy? Please please be good. It's not a it's not better if you die too. Let's seriously. That is a real fucked up situation. Fucking rough.
Oh. Hey, man. You promise you two, you don't shoot each other or nothing? Because you guys are really cool when you're cool. <laughs> that requires some 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 respect. <laughs> <laughs> it's complicated but she's 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 awesome <sighs> we will watch that another time.
bitch, you bought these for a reason. <laughs> just, uh, I made it through so much of that until right at the end. Cannot express how much I enjoyed that, man. Fuck, I love this show. Like, again, I, I knew... I knew when I first started it, I was going to enjoy it. But, um... Definitely didn't know... Just how much I was gonna. Um. Again, the worst part too is uh, I'm like I want to say so many things, but there's so many things that I I just I've, I've already said before about it. I, it's not a whole lot more I can say. Other than I'm just so fucking happy it had a happy ending, which is not. I was so fucking convinced I couldn't get that. And it's possible that maybe the reason is, is because of the existence of Steins Gate Zero. And again, I've, I've mentioned before, I originally saw that trailer for that forever ago. And maybe in that other version of episode 23 it does end significantly differently and less optimistically. And maybe that, maybe that does have a much less happy of an ending, which is why maybe then it wouldn't be much of an ending. It's just a jumping off point for the next part. Um, But yeah, man, I fucking loved it. I did. I enjoyed it so much. Getting to meet these characters in those first, what, 12? Well, okay, let's say 11 and 9 tenths of, <laughs> of, of <laughs> episodes. Um, I don't know, just getting to meet them and fall in love with them and eventually see them have to go through some real fucked up parts but still manage to pull through in the end makes me extremely happy. Again, I'm a character guy and the, again, I love them all to death. Like, I really do. I even, there's something I wasn't expecting is as soon as I saw fucking Moika show up as the, as, as the part-timer for fucking Mr. Braun, who, again, is another person who I'm in, in a situation where I'm like, you're kind of not great, but you're also kind of just taking care of your kid, too. But, uh, yeah, one of when she showed up, and uh, I was not expecting to immediately be like, oh, but I'm happy for her. And... Tis a crime that uh didn't get to see a little baby Souza or something like that at the end there, but seven years is seven or eight years is a little bit of time. <laughs> so still got a bit to go. Um like I said, I don't know what the context was. Um well, actually I guess I do. Again, this is kind of a long story, but I, I am aware of um her mother to an extent to like I don't I don't know personality or context or anything like that, but I I do have a name and face for her so at least I do have that going um and I don't know when that would be relevant or where it would be relevant but um yeah no that's, that's mm, stop it <laughs> I was just really convinced that that couldn't end well, and I'm um, just really happy to say that I was wrong on that front. Damn. Um, 
again, I, I, I don't, I wouldn't know where to begin to start with a favorite episode. Um, cause there's so many fucking good ones. I ad- adore the first half. Like, and a lot of people think it's a, a slow and it is slower for sure, but I am a character interaction guy and that shit is all over in those first, again, like 12 episodes. So I fucking love them all. Fucking, um, episode, I think it's, I think it's 16 if I remember correctly. Um, is it, is it Sacrificial Necrosis? Is that the title? Um, obviously holds a uh, place in my heart for obvious reasons. Um, but, uh, in a, in a, in a very sad way, but in a, in a good way too. Um, same with 22 again. I don't know, man. I just, I fucking loved it. I, I, I love these characters to death. Again, and I obviously, I, I have my, my, my best girl, but I, I, I cannot express how much I don't want that to in any way take away from the rest of the cast. Mayuri is adorable and a sweetheart. Okabe is a fucking weird, great, badass. Daru is a fucking, fucking doof, but I love him to death. Um, and Kurisu is, I guess the best way I could put it is Kurisu's fucking Kurisu. There's a reason everyone loves her, and there's a reason I love her too. Made me so happy to see them pull through in the end. It made me so happy to see her come back, and it was, I don't know. That little bit with them in the, the time machine as she was saying goodbye got me feeling a bit of a way as well. I don't know, man. Um, again, I wish I could say much more, but I don't know if I really can. Other than this is absolutely, without question, one of my all-time favorites. It absolutely, r- regardless of whether or not it takes over, over say, Sakraso or Franks for me as my all-time favorites, I, I don't know. Um... And again, I guess Ruby can be put up there as well. Um, but again, just for the sake of the argument, for the it's it's the only time I ever don't consider Ruby an anime is when I'm at, when I'm trying to give love to something else. It's because like otherwise uh, Ruby always wins, and it's fucking <laughs> it's, it's it's cheating at that <laughs> at that point. So I was like, it's just the show. It's my favorite show. Um, but uh, yeah. Without a doubt, it absolutely makes the top three, and it's very possible it it is my favorite, flat out. Um, I don't know yet. I definitely want to go through and see it again. I I'm I'm definitely going to um before we start zero. Um, there's gonna be a rough time getting into that again, but absolutely, I will be watching it through again before that. Um, again, I would like to go through and watch it in sub at some point. But I'm so fucking addicted to the dub cast, and I it, they they make these fucking characters for me. I can't Suzuho without Sheremy feels so weird and wrong. Even uh, even though I I, I really like uh, Kurosu's um, Savier, she she's great. Um, Trina fucking kills it as fucking Kurosu in this, and. I don't know, Daru. Daru is uh, one of my absolute favorites of the, of the, the, the difference between the two. He's just such a fucking real dude, which I think, um, I'm trying to remember. I literally just heard his voice again in something else. I can't remember what it was. Um, but I literally just been was it watching through something or I had to have been watching something, but I don't remember what it was. I was just watching through it, and I was like, oh, shit, this fucking daughter was voice. Hey, how you doing, my boy? Um, but I can't remember what it was. Um, yeah, and fucking uh, the, the man's himself, J. Michael Tatum, absolutely fucking rocking that shit again. Him and Jeremy are easily my two favorite English VAs, period, and to have them both in here fucking killing it is amazing. I don't know, man. I 
again, I, 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 there's not much more I can say other than I absolutely loved it. And I cannot express my thanks to you guys for joining me along with this, for giving it the massive amount of love and support that you guys did when it first started and for continuing to support it and love it because it makes me so happy seeing people love this thing that I really love. And you, it means the world to me seeing people show love to me that I doubt I really deserve. Just some schmuck over here crying over time travel goddess. You know how it is. <laughs> um, yeah. Thank you so much, guys. Um, again, I'm not sure when we're going to get to the OVA, if that's going to be next week or the week after. Um, but we will. And I am excited for it. Uh, hopefully it's going to be just a lot more, just a bit of a fun go about some 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 older school Steins Gate shit. Um, again, uh, there will be a significant little break um, before we get into zero. Um, going to have a, at least a series or so run through um, before we uh, put that up as an option again. Um, but I will say 100%, I intend to watch it flat out. There's there's no way I'm skipping it or something like that. Um, but yeah, so that is something I'm very much looking forward to. I very much want to see what they end up doing with it. I want to see so many new characters I know about. Um, which thankfully is, again, there's... I, I know of Sousa's mom, which I'm assuming is, is in Zero, but who knows? Maybe it could be a movie. I don't know. Um, uh, like, again, Sousa's mom. Uh, there's, there's a specific character in, in particular that fucking everyone and their mother has been like, fucking, there's a character in Steins Gate Zero who's the shit. Um, so <laughs> well, I've... Who I've been very much looking forward to that I'm aware of, and uh, very much looking forward to seeing her at some point. Um, yeah, so there's definitely some things I'm looking forward to. Um, again, don't know when we're going to do that. I don't know when we're going to do the movie, but I absolutely want to do that. <laughs> it's, fuck yes, I do. <laughs> um, again, I, I I probably won't be swapping out. Um, I want to eat your pancreas since that is the next one I had kind of planned as a subspecial. Um, but it's very possible I may adjust our subspecial schedule, I guess. Because, again, I had originally boosted it up to the next one being at 7.50 because we were going through shit really fast and growing. Um, um, but, again, there's so much stuff I want to watch that maybe it's just a good idea to keep it at 100 for a bit. Um or maybe I, I drop it down to seven. Maybe, maybe something I was thinking is maybe I do 600, 700, 800, 1,000. Maybe, but I don't know. We'll see. Again, I'm not sure. And who knows? It, again, as we grow more and more, it tends to grow faster and faster. So, um, Anyway, I, I I will be officially done here. Um, also as, as I've mentioned before, and as people have asked, um, I, I, again, I, I own Steins Gate and Steins Gate Zero on my PC now. Um, I'm looking, I'm going to pick up Elite for the, uh, Switch, um, because I don't think they have the regular version and I, I would totally pick up Elite even since I, since I, or I do own it on the PC as well. I'm like, fuck it, I'm not the, the regular version. And then I'm like, I'll pick up Elite on the, on the Switch, especially since I, I really like the anime art, so... Yeah. Which is weird too, because when I started, I didn't like it. I didn't like the I didn't like the way the like uh, female characters' faces were shaped. Because like they, like again, it's it's anime, so it's it's still fairly same overall basics, but it's just slightly different. As of this point, I'm just like I fucking love them. And Suza is like I don't give a damn. You're goddamn beautiful. Um, cannot express her goddamn look in these last few episodes. Holy shit, damn. Also, again, that outfit is very, very, like, either that or Homegirl just got some weird genetics this time around, and her tits got much smaller. I'm sorry, that's not, 
appropriate. <laughs> it's not appropriate. But if that was the case, I'm just going to say that's a fucking win for me because, I mean, again, I, I, she's amazing the way she is, but also, I mean, like, come on now. Um, I don't know. Anyway, I love you guys to death. I love this fucking cast. I love this fucking show. Thank you guys so much for spending your time with me. And I will see you guys whenever we end up checking out the OVA next. Um, again, we'll just hit it when we do and have a good time. Um, at least hopefully we'll, we'll have a very good time. And then, uh, yeah. Until then, guys. Uh, if anyone here is new or is still looking around to see anything else on the channel, obviously, again, uh, we have everything that's currently running. Um, I am very much looking forward to be starting up some other projects and content up here on the channel as we move along in the future here fairly soon. Um, which is again why I'm why I'm potentially going to be why I'm potentially going to be moving school live back and putting erased up front, and also why I might be putting bloom into you. I'm considering pushing bloom into you instead of. I'm I'm considering making Made in Abyss the first series that when we end it, it officially drops it uh, that slot off the schedule so that I can make room for other stuff. Which means if I do do that, then we won't jump into Bloom into You. Then we will have Bloom into You take over um, later on in the same way that us moving on and finishing up We Never Learn and Carolyn Tuesday would happen. If that makes sense to you guys, um, that's something I'm considering. Uh, I've, I've it's I've actually been considering it for like the past like two weeks, but I haven't been saying it. Um, we'll see. Uh, and yeah, I um, we have all those going. We have new stuff coming again in the way of like school live. Um, if you guys have an opinion on what I should do, if I should bump up Erased since that was the original next thing in line, or if I should just go with school live since that was what I kind of planned specifically for this continuation. But I don't know. We'll see. It doesn't matter to me. Um, I'm more worried about what you guys care about. It's just something I was thinking. Anyway, thank you guys so much. Uh, I will catch you guys next time, whatever it is. If you guys are sticking around, please, please tell me all about it. Tell me because I want to be like, hey, fucking hey, I want to meet you. Jump in the Discord. Come and hang out with us. Have a good time. Um, and uh, if anyone is, is going to be leaving either after this or after the OVA or whatever, uh, feel free to tell me that too so that I can at least say goodbye and give you guys a personal thanks and everything like that. So anyway. With that, I'm going to go. Thank you for joining me uh, with one of, if not my favorite, anime period at this point. Um, Hellside Kongru, motherfuckers. Love you some goddamn Suzuha. Love you some goddamn Kurosu. Love you some goddamn Okabe.